Welcome to Mainlining. Released January 26th, 2017. Developer Rebelevant. Publisher Merge Games. After MI7 has been hacked, your primary goal is to bring a cyber criminal network to justice. Played entirely from within the environment of your computer's desktop, Mainlining is a thrilling point and click hacking adventure that features a gripping narrative which will have you hooked from the very start. I'm guessing that's where it gets cut off. Okay. Rainbows. Unable to load image. Uh, don't restart. The screen appears again. Follow these steps. Click to make sure any progress wasn't lost. Mainlining. Start new. I see. We have a, a clever little way to begin our game here. Yeah, Rainbow MI7. Motherware. Uh, thank you. Good to be here. Type name. Um, my name is uh, the Chad King. My uh, my mouse is dying. Um, my picture is of a rogue. Next. Censorship data propaganda internal chat. Chad King has entered the chat. That's precisely what it says every time I enter the room. Uh, download it when you get a chance. Okay. Email clients. Damn it. The blogs are going to have a field day, Oswald. Hello. Why do I have to wait to read your daily case file to find out we've been breached? I don't know why. I'm new here. Thanks for welcoming me to MI7. So exciting to be a new receptionist. Sorry I wasn't in to greet you this morning. I went out of my way to bring muffins, but it took longer than I thought, and I missed you altogether. So it's your first day, and you were late because you were bringing in muffins. Ash, listen. The muffins, it's great. Good thought, but we need to talk about priorities here. Okay, it's your first day. You can't be late. Arrest guide, Captain Oswald. <clears throat> um, I will deliver results. I will follow every protocol. I pinky swear. Our hard drives have been wiped, so we're reinstalling everything from backup. You should start on your PC moment. Clearly, here's the case file. Uh, okay, well, first of all, let's get them guidelines, and then we'll get the case file, and then we'll check our downloads. Arrest guide. The new three-tier online arrest system is as follows. Selling prohibited items, drugs, drug pay, family contracts, stolen property, stolen data, stolen software, a sentence of five years. Data theft, identity theft, computer fraud, wire fraud, sentence of 15 years. Developing software, unlicensed, developing malicious software, de delivering prohibited software. 25 years? Holy shit. That's the harshest punishment. You get more time for writing malware than you do for identity theft or wire fraud? That seems wrong. But I guess whatever. You're the boss, Mr. Oswald. Case file. Well, I like that we have a... We can actually move the... So many of these games I play, you you have a, what is supposed to be a desktop, and you can't even do basic desktop things like moving windows and stuff. This is... Is this really loud for you guys? Because it's really loud for me with the music. <clears throat> I'm actually concerned. I'm going to turn that down a little bit. Actually, can I turn it off? Men oh, there we go. Music. I don't need the music. Thank you. I get enough copyright strikes as it is. Okay. On um, 20... Hold on. I'm an American. I don't understand this date. What could this possibly signify? Do they have more than 12 months in Europe? Keep your hat on. Applications are reinstalling. Well, fuck Sharp. I didn't say anything. Cool your goddamn jets, man. Anyway, on August... 
28th, 2010, MI7 suffered a serious breach, resulting in data loss and investigation is underway to determine how to perpetrate to gain access to the old kingdom's of fire. Our search is currently focused on www.freedomwire.bp, an unindexed file sharing website that appears to be engaged in illegal activity across multiple sectors. Okay, I gotta read. Give me time to read, okay? <laughs> okay, sure. Um, after gaining access to our system, an uninvited guest logged in from a known Freedomware moderator account, Muscleboy81. Discover the identity of the owner of the screen name Muscleboy81 and connect the guilty party to evidence linking them to another crime. Sharp. Uh, okay. Should That should really should go without saying. Sharp. I get that. The public must not be made aware of it. And, uh, search, okay. Well, that the public should be aware of it, but, you know, whatever. Uh, meet up. Hey, again, maybe we should get a drink and have a proper chat sometime. I don't know. Ash, you're coming on kind of strong. Do we even know each other? Um, get a drink? I mean, that's serious. That's serious stuff. I mean, Jesus. Maybe say hello first. I suppose. Muffins as foreplay is a novel approach. I appreciate that in a woman. Checking the site out now. Well, okay. Then I guess, oh, three pieces of information are required to initiate an arrest. Name, location, and it's next. The suspect's location must be the district where they are found at the moment of the arrest initiation. This must be the request. Okay. Evidence is imported from your documents folder. Be sure to download the file you need. Only use one piece of evidence. Only use one piece of evidence may be submitted to connect a suspect to a crime. Okay. Here is the people. The username is Muscleboy, so I'm expecting a boy, but that isn't necessarily true. Could be anyone. Be anyone at all. All right, let's go check out the site. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> freedom fire uh we don't have a maximize or minimize and i can't resize which is too bad because that would be exactly what i want to do right now uh between the five moderators on this site we have 15 years of experience we never leave our bedrooms slash pcs mi7 Okay. Hello, agent. For information on commands, type help. Clear. Help. IP hack. Just IP hack to hack into a computer with their IP. Uh, ping website. I know your website's IP. Switch. Logged in user. Okay. All right. I, I, we will hack. What's your apps, right? Yes, I have the two apps. Uh, why would I? Oswald. Chill, dude. We're just getting started here. The Wachowski's ASCII. We can't actually go into any of these. Can you just get rid of this Mr. Muscle Boy 81, please? Swap his keck with barbiturates if you have to. Uh, oh my god. Special cases coming soon. We do have a back button. Thank you. Thank you for that. Grand trunk. So, uh, to... The, uh, so, <clears throat> if you've been following the channel, you know that uh, I have been on the lookout for a good OSINT game, or just a computer investigation game. I tried Cyber Manhunt, I tried uh, Orwell, and I think those are the two main ones I've tried. There might have been a couple of other ones in there. I'm not including puzzle games like the the um, Hack Run series. Um, those were not hacking investigation games. They were just kind of 
adventure puzzle games. Um, Cyber Manhunt and Orwell didn't really live up to what I'm looking for in a game like that specifically. They they were okay. They had good points and bad points. Um, but that's what I'm hoping to find in this. Um, I'm not looking for a hacking simulator. So the fact that you can just type IP hack and put an IP in there, that's okay. I can live with that as long as the actual investigation part is decent. Um, and what we have so far, of course, Freedom Wire is an in-game analog for the old file sharing sites like LimeWire, which they haven't been a thing for years now. Uh, this was released in 2017. It definitely wasn't a thing by 2017. The site we discovered right now, this Grand Trunk site, um, is clearly an in-game analog for the Silk Road, which was an on online dark web drug marketplace uh, run by a user uh, known as the Dread Pilot Pirate Roberts, turned out to be named uh, Robert Ulrich, um, who, well, that's a whole story in and of itself, but if you're interested in that kind of thing, I definitely recommend reading about that story and all of the other cases that came out of it attached to it. Um, and I'm saying that because camel logo drug marketplace and so on that was actually rated in 2015 so the fact that it's in the game 2017 i mean that makes sense right it's around that time so it's uh roughly relevant so um you know we have some connections to to real world things um pinging a website to get their ip address uh doesn't work in uh, many cases uh because um i mean it can if we're talking about a limited number of web servers you look at the ip of the web server but then these days the way the internet is structured uh with edge servers and um uh, load balancing and so on um generally you don't get um a direct ip but what what was that mr hello mr green i see you're trying to access my machine say hello to my friend mr red okay Okay. What's happened? Well, it seems that they have hacked back, if you can believe it. No doubt to prevent me from using IP hack against them. I'll disconnect his head from his kicked up body. Oswald, dude. Less coffee in the morning, okay? It's, it's quarter after ten. It's way too early for the shit, okay? IT says the rest, the reset password should be on our desktops somewhere. So why must they always move everything? Oh, well, I mean, they're making it pretty easy for us. They put a password on our desktop, for God's sake. This is supposed to be a secret government organization. <laughs> Where is my coffee? Guy reminds me of uh, 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 Colin Farrell's character from uh, Horrible Bosses. Already too coked up for this. Alright, let's... He must be guarding the network. I'm guessing it's accessible. No, that's just notes. If you still have mainline open, note the IP so he doesn't see us coming again. Okay. Will do. I can't select anything. Okay, I'll just have to copy it down then. Two, three, four. 208.210. Okay, you're covering up my shit. 104.182. Okay. Can I reply? Uh, 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 he said case. <laughs> okay. Um, I see no. That's my documents. I see no desktop. I see no password on my desktop. Can I close the chat? No, cannot. Okay. Uh, I'm not sure what to do then. It's not here. It's not here. Can't enter anything into there. I my back up currently offline. Can't type anything. Okay. Is it in the bin? 
Hack. Hack basic. What's this? <clears throat> okay. Hack area. Okay. And that helped. Oh, okay, there we go. M I seven office change. So down here? Okay. That's supposed to be the network icon, huh? Oh, I suppose it is. It didn't look like it when it was offline, but I see it now. Back online. IP hack. See how good my memory is. Two three four two oh eight one oh four one eight two. Let's see how I did. Fucking nailed it. Find a name and any evidence linking to the blah muscle boy. Any illegal. Mm -hmm, sure. Logged into Freedom Wire. Freedom Wire. Hello, Freedom Wire. Freedom Wire's fires. Files. I did. Any. Uh, dude, I just got in. Uh, okay. What is the. What can I do? I'll download list turn oh type um rework ratings and star system on users post feedback remove ads and actually host content so that's a radical idea my friend radical idea mod names all right we got his name oh shit it Gets rid of your notes. Now let's see how good my memory is. Uh, 208 104 182. Um, muscle Boy 81 Brad Clay. It's not okay, whatever. Got a name. Freedomware is by revenue generated by the by the is the by the by the the by 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 the Really solidly in the mission of bringing safe products to the audience and one of them with as little restriction of government interference as possible. It seemed like things as you should do this and interfering with the government. This is also the internet. Let's talk about this. I think I'm going to get a 420 kit. Okay. Uh, was there anything else I could do other than. So I can't navigate info. Freedom Wire. Freedom Wire, Thorn Group, IP address, location central. Okay. But I can't do anything else. So. Um, so I can come down here. Oh, let's first look at that group photo. Um, okay. Clay, 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 clay. Oh, C. Clay, clay, clay. Brad Clay. Ah, I see you, buddy. Facial comparison. Positive. We got him. All right, resident central. Is that it? Brad Clay Mail is central blogger. Okay, location is central. Oh, we need to know where. Yeah, it's central. Central, that's where uh, LimeWire, that's right. sorry, not LimeWire, FreedomWire was hosted, and it said they never leave. Evidence, group photo, arrest. Book him, Dano. What? What? What I do? Um, okay, hold on. Let me double check. You're the guy, you're the, you guys are the one who told me to find Muscle Boy 81. Did I do the name wrong? Hmm. 
Muscle Boy 81. Brad Clay. Um... Okay. Who is four twenty kid? Any son. Uh and she said Uh I'm bringing safe products to the audience that wanted them with as little restriction or government interference as possible. It seems like things have shifted with some parties taking an active interest in interfering with the government. Okay. Not sure what I got wrong. Owner is Thorn Group. That's right, that's right. Location Central. I I'm not sure what else I could even do uh, if I don't have the right information. Uh, this turn. Turn. What do I have? Okay. Okay. Um, I don't know. Seems like there's a very limited amount of information available to me, so... I'm not sure what I could possibly have missed. Find a name and any of it. I'm thinking Muscle Boy, anything illegal. All right, so. Or does he not live in Central? It's no, because it said he did. His res residence is Central. Uptown, twenty seven, Tokyo. That that's got to be right. So, I suppose the group photo isn't actually evidence; just evidence that he's a moderator. So, is it the case file? Is that what I should have? No. Okay. Then what am I doing wrong? He did refer to me as Mr. Lou. Okay, let's check out the other name that we had there. Any son. Everyone from known occupation coder. No, I, I don't have any reason to suspect her. Um, okay. Is there a... Uh... No? Okay. Um, <clears throat> alright, well clearly we're missing some information. I'm not sure what, but... Uh, let's go back to the site. They're the ones who told me to find Muscle Boy 81. If Muscle Boy 81 isn't actually responsible for this, then that's kind of not on me. Prepare oh, there's a download button. Preparing the incredible bulk. What if I do this? Preparing. 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 Um. Special cases coming soon. Well, these are also members of the Thorn Group. We saw. Oh, okay, hold on. We got something new. Maps once said. It.
activists connected by a common drive for real fundamental justice. <clears throat> we believe in absolute freedom and openness and deplore the control of information, economics, and society itself by government and oligarchic capitalist overlords. We will attack any structure or actor who restricts freedoms and promotes inequality in the name of false security. Well, so far, <clears throat> I don't see any problem with any of that. I can agree with that. So they are the ones behind the Silk Road analog, the LimeWire analog, and the special cases thing. Download manifesto, sure. Uh, who really are the lions, and a guide to being someone else. Let's start with uh, manifesto. Thorn Thorn Manifesto, to, uh, our intentions are clear to make MI7 pay for its... Okay, so these are the ones responsible for our attack, okay. <clears throat> uh, for the benefit of the public, any services will sell, which the government seemed even more all give the public what they crave, and their operation insurance is okay. That is uh, not a... Uh, that's not a very good manifesto. It's uh, short and generic. Uh, the Lions... I keep double clicking. It doesn't want me to double click. The lions is nothing more. The lions is, the lions is is, nothing more than a name the rats from MI7 gave themselves. But consider, while lions are majestic, powerful creatures, MI7 rats are little more than a cowardly, overreaching government-funded and controlled. It club, okay. Words hurt. Okay, words hurt. A guide to becoming someone else by MuscleBoy81. I'll admit I've stolen identities for my own use many times. It's not hard. <clears throat> Often I'll start by finding a way into a MyFace account. People leave all kinds of personal information lying around. Uh, okay, so that's our evidence, I'm guessing, then, because that's definitely an admission of doing something illegal. <clears throat> Okay, blogger sentenced to 15 years for theft. That's what it was. We just didn't quite have the right information, which is true. We only had a picture that showed that he was a moderator of Freedom Wire. It's just, I didn't. That was my fault for trying to, th for thinking that, uh, for playing a game instead of thinking. I thought that the game had easily led us to our first conclusions, but not so. Okay, um, okay, we got him. <clears throat> censorship data propaganda clay talked in detention something about hair okay it's some kind of club drug running through ocean beach airport what are we doing with this intel Hey there, you. So I hope this isn't too forward, but seeing as I'm new in town, I have to make a bit of effort to get out there and meet people and find my bearings. I was thinking maybe you could show me around. I bet you know all the best secret spots. Ash, the, okay, listen. I know that this is probably your first assignment, but when you're running a honey pot, you have to keep it you got to keep it down, okay? You're making it too obvious what you're doing. It's it's clear you're a foreign agent, and you're trying to ingratiate yourself with the, the best agent MI7 has, but you're going to have to... You, you, i got to get up pretty early in the morning, okay? You, it's just not going to work. <sighs> case files are going on. Blah, blah, blah. Here is the new case file. Apologies for the puny subject line. Cooper made me download... Award winner, Great News Team, HU, the International News Security Syndicate, confers with the, uh, with the NS. <laughs> uh, 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 the most distinguished service of Professor Gerald Wedge, head of, head of NS. I keep wanting to say INAS, but NS is so much funnier. <clears throat> Our own Captain Oswald. Well, I can see he works so hard, and uh, you know, uh, so I've never uh, so deserving, so deserving. MI seven has enlisted the services of MI five Special Agent Cooper for work in the field. The agent will interrogate or intercept a delivery of hair from the Ocean Beach Airport, fit it with a tracking mechanism, and return it to our associate at Special Cases BP. 
where it will be held for pickup by our suspect. In this case, it's first and foremost a fact-finding mission, but we must still hit arrest targets, bring in a suspect on the credible charges. Go to MI7WB to download the tracking map. Hey, I shall. Ensuring your cyber safety. Employee. Today's inspiration. Oh, I love these. Oh, oh, worm and fuzzies. I, I love the corporate mottos and, and mascots. It's, it's, you know, it's just like when whenever you get started at a new place and they, they try telling you that everyone there is a family. It just makes you feel so welcome, doesn't it? It's not at all menacing in any way. So here it is, I would say, our top priority, because for all the exciting things you will be able to do with computers, organizing your lives, staying in touch with people, being creative, if we don't solve these security problems, then people will hold back the most ironic of all quotes. Ooh, a parking permit. Yeah. Hey, Earth. Don't mind if I do. Let me check out that permit. We really made it. You get to print it and cut it out yourself. Yeah, install that shit. I love, I love watering holes. I totally buy that MI7, a secret government organization, would use the in-game analog to Google Maps. For sure. All right, Agent Cooper. Got you on the comm. En route to tracing the parcel. Why have we not upgraded his speech to text? Oh, sorry, parasol. Uh, he likes the old one more. Yeah, Oswald, what are you going to do? You can't control everything, buddy. You got to learn to loosey-goosey. Let, let it go. Not to engage. Yeah, Agent Cooper. I I hear you're Aladdin clear. No, I hear you all clear. Yeah, Agent Cooper. Don't fall in love. There's the special cases, HQ. They helpfully put a gigantic goddamn brownie or whatever the hell it is on top. Keep your head down and don't tip anyone off. Ivy goat on the parasol. Oh, moo. Oh, okay, I can type now. Tracker on. Sorry, Coop, what? I can't make out what you're trying to say. Sharp, are you... You're not very sharp, apparently. Clearly, he said, I've got the package on my way. They've just left. Yes, I can see that. In pure suit. Don't let them get away. Why did we put a tracker on it if an agent was literally going to tail them to the location? What is the point of putting a tracker if an agent is literally going to eyeball them the whole way? Target's headed, headed into the diner. Heady into the diner. Same as two bees meeting somebody. Keep your distance. Agent Cooper, I think you're going to have a bad afternoon. He's loved without the parasol. I have loved without parasols before. Follow the driver. We have the hair on our end. We sure do. Can I zoom in and out? No, I cannot. There it goes. It's on the move. Where is it going? We're out of nowhere. Damn, lost him? No, we didn't. We got him right here. Oh, you lost the suspect. Okay. Ah, make yourself useful. Jeez, Oswald, you're fucking, you're such a fucking dick.
and Interbux in Drexel. What's the deal with Interbux? Find me everything. There must be some money moving around online. Bank accounts, invoices, paper trails. Perhaps. Ash? <laughs> it doesn't even let me, like, reply, so this is all, like, part of the game. Okay. Um, is there a search? Interbucks. Custom coffee. So you know, bucks trend. Oh, excuse me. Our managers, who are they? Joe Green Kings. But we are in Drexel, so... Brett James, I recognize that face. Uh, okay. All right. Oh, I can do tabs. Okay, that's neat. Uh, what did that say? Grab nice espresso. Oh, cheers. Well, actually. Musings, Life, and Coffee by Brett James. Brett James, you sound like a real card. You sound like a man I'd like to have a beer with, but you probably don't drink beer unless it is microbrewed IPA. Musings, Life, and Coffee? How whimsical. You are an out-of-the-box thinker, my friend. I would like to twirl your hipster mustache. The Scourge. Seems Java Joe was unimpressed with the comment I left on his recent MyFace post about the so-called Scourge of people using laptops in coffee shops. Don't people have offices to go to? He asks the poor dear. My comment for reference, well, actually, Joe, if you did more reading and less whinging, maybe you'd already know that the very concept of the modern office was born of the coffeehouse culture. I mean, for crying out loud, Barlow's itself started out in a coffee shop. Coffee and productivity have a long association, and there is nothing antisocial about it. This is just one reason I'm so proud to offer Wi-Fi access free of charge at Interbucks. Comments closed. Express here those of the writer and do not reflect those of Bumbler. Ah, well, I mean, I suppose I would uh, I like to go to the office to go to work about as much as I'd like to go to a coffee shop, so they at least have that in common. The CCC. My own mother forwarded me the most ridiculous report about so-called Civet Cat Coffee excuse me, that supposedly gains value after being shat out by a cat. First of all, civets are not cats. They're perverts. Secondly, if you know anything at all, then you know that the only reason this coffee might be any good at all, and that's a really big might, is that civets are choosy about which coffee cherries they eat, so they're only shitting the best coffee. But... Does it sound practical to you to go picking through the woods to find only the best civet, civet shit? No. People are caging these animals and force-feeding them crap coffee cherries. See what I did there? I... Oh, <laughs> yeah. I see it now. I see it now. So, congratulations. You just spent 50 quid on garbage coffee processed through the arse of a musky animal. Enjoy. Thanks for nothing, Mom, if that is your real name. If you want real coffee processed by professionals, come to Innerbucks. We'll even throw in a shot of hazelnut for you. No musk on the house. <laughs> I hope you're fucking guilty so we can take you off the streets. You're a fucking menace. A question. What passes for an espresso these days? Uh, I know I said an espresso. Fucking sue me. 
I tell you, it's like no one even knows what espresso is anymore. For reference, espresso is water boiled to 195 to 205 degrees and pulled through finely ground coffee for 18 to 23 seconds at 8 to 10 bars of pressure, resulting in precisely 3 quarters to 1 ounce of coffee. Anything else is just caffeine water. You might as well just snort cocaine at that point. Well, then I guess that's what I'll do. Brent. Bumbler. Okay. Well, Brett's insufferable. Um, let's see. Should we do the thing? Ping. Well, actually, no big ping. Oops, not pig. Ping. Oh, I can't. There's no. Okay, you have to. I mean, this is uh, supposed to be, this is Bumbler, so the in-game analog to Tumblr. Uh, so I really shouldn't be going after them. Um, because they're just hosting the content, but at the same time, not Pig. Enter Bucks. Bucks, Bucks, Bucks. At the same time, I'm not sure what to expect out of this game in terms of uh, sophistication and following protocol and stuff. So, um, I suppose we shall, IP hack, uh, we shall give it a shot. That's the wrong IP address. 239-145-17834. Hello, Brett. Type login. Uh, so she's her username, iBucks Coffee. Um, welcome to Interface. Okay. Are these just the posts? Like, there's no tab complete. Uh, yes. Yes, they are just those. So, oops. Is it return they wanted me to type? Yeah. IP we are going to go ahead and hack into uh, Okay, switch Mailbox Coffee Well, that didn't make any sense, but okay Jimmy Jones. Um, is I don't stop it. Did you see this forum comment on Grand Trunk? Lions must die. Is that us? Lions want me to investigate. Everyone's a critic. Ignore it, dude. Oswald, this is clearly related. They literally have a note. They are working against us. This is obviously... Okay, whatever. Uh, find some records showing movement of money and bring the perp in. Okay. Well, I do you have proof of money movement. Selling expenses. Uh, here, Jim Jones, right there. Return. IP. Hack. Five one five two two six boom boom. I am a real hacker now. I don't remember to bring your prayer book this weekend, love dad. Hope the movement well. I'm sure you'll never get a chance to leave Drexel. Okay, so it lives in Drexel.
Um, hey, Jimmy, it's Brett from work. Just wanted to say thanks for covering that shift last week. It was a big help. See you Monday. Okay. Through. I'm not sure if we should arrest Brett or Jimmy. Jimmy's got the stuff, so. Location. Tricks. Camps. Maurice is sentenced to five years for selling prohibited items. Official confirmed the suspect has been arrested in connection with the online sale of restricted items as part of MI7's vigorous new mandate to crack down on cybercrime. Jimmy Jones was taken in custody in Drexel at 10.28 after selling a party drug keck to an undercover agent online. The 23-year-old barista is set to stand trial for misuse of digital technology. If convicted, he faces a sentence of five years in prison and is expected to plead not guilty. We need to follow up on that car, Cooper tracked and lost. Managed to get a dash cam photo of the vehicle. Uh, options. So I was thinking of asking out Frankie from IT. Thoughts? By the way, you don't happen to watch Wolfhaven Nights, do you? So wanted to talk about last night's ep. Be gone, thought. <laughs> Here's a photo of the car that gave us a slip. UT86FAL car.bp. Okay. Oh, he's got the sticker for the Silk Road, too. Here's the case file, pretty straightforward. During the hair affair, a special agent keeper successfully tracked a vehicle of interest and captured a photo, including identifying details. Please use the details in the captured image to find the vehicle and arrest its owner. Waste no time in bringing them in. Okay. We keep your personal data safe so you can concentrate on your drive. Okay. Satellite navigation devices, you say? Well, I think that's the kind of thing I would be interested in knowing. Two, two, three, seven, one, five, eight. Stop giving me notes. Oh, really? Hello, car. <clears throat> okay, Bud Stern, Ocean Beach. Um, I'll order roadblocks. You want to make it past the five districts, okay? Uh, but that's it, huh? There's no. There's nothing else. Um, Stern is not his real name, huh? Bud Stern, Ocean Beach. UT eight six FAO. There is no Bud Stern. There's a Phil and a Janet. It's probably Phil. But he is a lawyer. Oh, well, they're both lawyers. Looks like a purpose of Mr. Bud Stern. Well, yeah, that's what I just said. Of Stern Stern? Ah, uh, they're why a husband and wife, I see. Not sure. Well, yes, I'm looking at them right now. They're both lawyers, so that must be the name of their firm. Check their site, see if you can find anything. 
Okay, then I shall. Based in Uptown, Stern Stern is an international legal firm established in 1985, specializing in business and family law. We serve clients based all over the world. Ask about our special rates and free personal consultation for new clients wishing to transfer from competing firms and coincide. Okay, got their email addresses. Should I hacksaw them? Two three zero oh, three nine two zero oh, three. That's not the number. Three nine two zero oh, three one six zero. Oh. Ah, uh, our email license you need. If you could do that on your own, I'd be so proud. That's my plan. But I also need a better computer for making games. This Payotex machine can't handle it. I was hoping you and Dad could help. Uh, okay, Bud Stern is their kid. You just paid your car insurance, no bud. You're going to have to work this out on your own. We've got a business to run, and you know your dad's very busy with his pony team stuff or whatever it's called. Um, wait. I have email. No, not IP bucks. Alright, dear Mr. Cern, we are interested in hiring you and your team to look over a current issue we are having with MI7 due to someone dealing, some dealing which went on with the company money, but not company knowledge. These are linked to websites grandhunks.bp and torn.bp. If you could research and get back to us, that would be great. Um... I don't know if you're familiar with my work already, but I'm a journalist with Cab News, or CCB News, sorry. I was wondering if I could get your company's take on the Blue Pill Act and the power it gives MI7. Recently, there has been a stream of quick arrests with no information needing to be given on where the evidence was obtained. Your thoughts on the subject would be very interesting to our readers. Kind regards. Okay. So Bud is their son. Uh, Philip, oh, what's his name? Philip, piece of shit. Uh, BP. Phil Ippos. What the fuck? Uh... <laughs> Fills into My Little Pony? <laughs> um, I mean, this was 2017. Um, okay, so... Uh, okay, hold on a sec. What was it? Grand... Grand Hunks. BP. Brand punks dot bp okay born dot bp from the producers of malevolent torn love will tear you apart valentine's day 2011 i'm guessing that the 2017 is just when it was released to steam because all of the dates in the game are referencing like 2009 2010 2011 so um, why won't this work, though? Grand Hunks BP. Let me make sure I'm spelling it right. 
G R A N D G R A N D H U N K S H U N yeah that should be it. Okay, I failed to connect. Okay. Uh, I don't know. Sure, um, could be money, but not. Is only to the websites? Okay, I don't know what's up with that. Let's check that out. I guess the only one. Oh, that's actually try Grand Hunks. Uh, no, it's not working. The hell. Okay. All right. I don't know what that's about. Two three zero one nine five two two four three six eight. No files found. Well, that's a dead end then. Let's go back to the uh, site here. Make sure we didn't miss anything then. Starting us on the right side. Can I send them an email? No, oh, can't. Okay. So, what's put into then? And now also, Bud Stern isn't in our database. Just those two. So, now I'm not sure where to go. Let's see. Um, oh, we didn't, uh, we didn't, um, uh, film piece of shit dot BOP. It's just one L. Uh. <laughs> Yes. If that's the stuff he puts out on the public website, can't imagine to see what other files are hidden in here. Some My Little Pony slash fit going on. Bill Stern. For crying out loud, fine. Just don't mention it to anyone else. I'll handle it. Me and your mother have been talking, and if you need to save money, you should just come back to home. Can't have you getting into trouble with the law. I just forwarded you the invoice so you know how bad it is. I just told you to delete it. Um, sold by Mr. Blue. Right. Our system isn't turning up any Bud Stern. How's that possible? That's why we got hacked. We got a confession out of I know who Bud is and bring them in. Okay. Uh, sold by Mr. Blue. Okay. Ah, uh, I wish I could have Um, full at heart. Jean 
Stern, Bud, 79. Bud Stern, 420 Lewis. Classy. Yes. One, is this the thing? I, I'm gonna guess that those are the, yeah, let's see, maybe those. Okay, there we go. Sure, make sure Flock knows not to release this real name. I want to. Um, let's also download Western Bud's order. Hello, Mr. Jimmy Jones. Thanks for your order. Order number, blah, blah, blah. Order total. Dispatched uh, from Central Motherboard 1, so by Mr. Baloo. Um, Sharp, what's happened to our homepage? I don't know. I never look at it. This is a disgrace. I'm going to guess the explanation starts with a T and rhymes with horn. Oh, goodness. What's happened to our site? I don't even remember what our site is. Uh, is it just MI7.bb? Invading your privacy. Well, I mean, you're right. Spies. Kill the lions. Security is, I would say, okay, that's the same thing. It just says drones instead of employees and career. Just don't even bother unless you're a complete tosser. Well, I am. There's a place for me, too, you know. Uh, found out benefits, spent all day spying on the same citizens who ultimately paid their wages without the help of the unconstitutional people. They would barely be able to find the power of other pieces. I'd like surprise you. Okay, yeah, I mean, words hurt. Words hurt, guy. Okay. Uh, so we have passwords now so now i can uh return switch uh bud stern 420 lewis ah blaze bud i gotcha smoke weed every day Notice is hereby given a change of name dated 11309 and registered by the upper courts on 12399. Wow, it took 90 years. What? <laughs> oh really i can't okay fine the the there's even the notepad is severely limited in terms of its features i can't actually go up and down lines um what was it warm sands warm shore ah <sighs> Our intentions are clear to make it myself. Okay, that's the manifesto. We saw that. Budster. So, I think someone was following me the other day. I've got a little bit over my head. And that guy's going to just come out of the case. It's cooking this optimizer out for you. Pretty happy with it. Just don't share it with anyone, as I don't actually have a dev license. Uh, so then that's proof of illegal activity right there. This is not supposed to be doing that without a license. All right, Mr. Blaze, if that is your real name. Good Blaze. Pizza delivery. Uh, warm sands, warm sands, warm shore, I mean. Work email. Arrest. 
What? Wrongly accused. What are you talking about? Did I choose the wrong file? Uh, yeah. I can't. They don't. They didn't save me. The the thing, the thing with the thing. The um. Um. The uh, offenses and punishments. They didn't leave that with me, but I'm almost positive that there was. Like, the steepest penalty was for un un unlicensed software development. Or maybe that was just malware. I don't know. Uh, let's go back. Switch. Janet Stern. Mud. 79. She, you might think that she gets her password from her son's name, but in truth, she too. Bit of a pothead. Uh... Change my name, so uh, bug laser, weekly change it, just want to let you know. Now I won't ruin the family name. Ha ha ha, why would you do that? Okay. Download family. Let me download your family. Uh, yeah, that's... That's Bud, that's his picture. So... I guess maybe I was wrong about, um, oh, what is this, by the way? Um, oh, is, this is betting code. Okay, that's probably what I should have attached. It's proof of his development. No, wrongly accused. Okay. Uh, okay, that seems pretty clear to me. It's for cheating at thing, but whatever. All right, so um, that seems pretty clear evidence. So I don't think it's this. Or I think this is right. I think the name is right. I think we, we got him because we saw his picture. Uh, let's try... Turn. Did we log in as... Bill Stern. Full at... Lunch. Yeah, we did see this. Okay. Which one he blaze it? When you come back now, like you said to, see you soon. Oh, oh, his current location then would be his parents' house. That's probably what we're doing wrong. So he's not at Warm Shore right now. He is, he is, he is uptown. He's an uptown girl. So not warm shore. Upton. And that's got to be it. There we go. 25 years for that. Software development. Okay. That's what it was. Okay. Well, I'm uh, I'm about done uh, on this one. Uh, I don't think I'm going to come back for part two. Um, because, okay, so like I said at the outset, I'm looking for a really good computer investigation game. Um, and honestly, this one I enjoyed a lot more than even Orwell or Cyber Manhunt, despite the fact that those, uh, those games have more features, uh, they definitely have a slicker UI, um, and more variety in the tasks and stuff. Um, there's parts of those games I really don't like, which is why I don't recommend them. This game does not have the bad things. Um, but I'm still, this one's still not exactly what I'm looking for, uh, because it is in fact very easy. 
Um, there's two commands that we needed to worry about. The puzzles weren't that difficult. It wasn't really that tricky. Um, the last one kind of threw me off there with his current location, but because there's so little information in front of you, it's really easy to disambiguate. And what I'm really looking for in, in an investigation game is one that does the opposite of that, that gives you so much information that you have to sift through it, because that's what an investigation is. It's a process of disambiguation. And this game is this is good this is just like orwell and cyber manhunt there's a lot of potential here um but uh this one doesn't have their shortcomings but it does have different shortcomings those games did have more information for you to sift through but they made it easy by kind of highlighting the important things and holding your hand throughout the entire process rather than allowing you to gather information that you determined to be important uh, this one doesn't do that, but it does. Pre it presents so little information that it's obvious what you're supposed to be doing, um, or where you're supposed to go at any given time. So, this one again is good. Not what I'm looking for really in a game. Uh, for that reason, I wouldn't recommend it for wh for what it is. Uh, but a fun little distraction nonetheless, and it was definitely a lot less annoying to play than Orwell or Cyber Manhunt because those games, despite their uh, the features that they offer and the gameplay that they offer, um, have some parts of them that are extremely irritating. So that will be it then for um, oh my god, what game is this again? Um, mainlining. <laughs> mainlining. Um, so we'll see you on the next one. Bye.